guys, how are you doing today? Welcome back to Random Lifestyle Vlog. So today we're going to unbox the Spring uh, Beauty Drop Box from Ability London. And uh, this is something between kind of like a beauty subscription and a gift with purchase, I would say. It generally works like that. They take £20 out of your account every month uh, and then you can spend that money on whatever you want on Liberty London and then you receive one of these boxes every three months. So it's literally like free but you kind of have to spend some money with them. I personally really like this formula because I always buy their advent calendar, sometimes I actually buy some of their collections as well, uh, but obviously it will only work if you have stuff to buy from Liberty London, because if you don't, then this might not be the best idea. It does work for me, so I'm always excited to get a little box of freebies like every three months. Okay, so let's have a look what's uh, in this spring box. So I'm just going to give you a quick sneak peek, there you go. As usual, we'll have this little kind of like booklet here that will tell us a little bit about each uh, product inside. So the first thing that I picked up is a bar of soap. <laughs> okay, I know that some of you are not really too excited uh, when you get like bars of soap, but I actually use them. I use them. I just, you know, I always have like a bar of soap in my bathroom. So yeah, that is not necessarily the most exciting thing in the world, but definitely very useful to me. So this is Granado Bossa Bar Soap. In a nutshell, evoking the lush coastline of the brand's hometown, the Bossa Bar Soap from Gran Granado ex exudes a fresh, blossoming and summery fragrance. This sumptuously creamy, vegetable-based soap is infused with murmur butter to deliver nourished, cleansed and moisturized skin. Simply lather up in a shower bath to envelop skin in a fragrant light foam that is sure to bring a touch of Rio de Janeiro sunshine to your daily ritual. They said so many things about this fragrance, I kind of need to need to have a sniff. Yeah, it does have like a really nice fragrance to it, but you know, the way it was described, I kind of expected something like extraordinary. Whereas it's just like a nice smelling bar of soap. Okay, so that was our first product. The second product, oh, it's just like a piece of paper. Okay, so the, the, the sec second product is a single 111 Skin Rose Gold Eliminating Eye Mask. And I've had so many of these uh, in the recent years and I love them. Combat dry dull skin with this 111 Skin's game-changing rose gold illuminating eye mask infused with medical grade ingredients to instantly revive and brighten the delicate under eye area. The ultimate rescue for tired looking eyes, the mask uh, utilizes yeast protein to ultimately balance skin tone whilst promoting long-lasting luminosity. So I've tried that before, I love it. This is not necessarily a new product for me, but definitely something I actually highly rate. Uh, and I keep these in my fridge because then you have this additional kind of cooling effect under your eyes. So yeah, that is actually quite cool. Uh, let's move on. The next product is this mini Sunday Riley Good Jeans Glycolic Acid Treatment. And we have eight mils over here so this is like a little travel size so i definitely had like a smaller bottles of this product so uh, eight mils is it's not bad at all uh this is a really nice exfoliating serum like overnight serum uh it even though it does contain glycolic acid it does not irritate my skin but uh this is just, you know, the way my skin reacts. Everyone's different. Um, if you're new to acids, it's best to take things slowly, step by step, uh, introducing your acids, like maybe starting with like once a week and then just increasing uh, that to like, I don't know, like maybe not daily. I don't think um, daily exfoliation is a must for like most skin types, especially if you have dry or sensitive skin. It's definitely not something you need to de do too often. Sunday Riley's Good Jeans is an award-winning glycolic acid treatment unrivaled in, in its ability to deeply exfoliate and repair skin. Penetrating deep into the skin surface with tiny particles of the hero ingredients glycolic acid, this formula delivers a thorough breakdown of pore clogging dirt and debris when used as a part of your daily skincare routine. So apparently you can use it daily, but as I just said, uh, if you have sensitive on, or dry skin, uh, daily exfoliation is not necessarily something that may work for you, uh, but you know, always do what works best for you. Next up we have something uh, by Davines, and this is actually really like this brand. Uh, this is a shampoo. I'm usually not very excited when I get a shampoo, especially when I don't have a matching conditioner. Um, but I actually had a shampoo uh, from this brand before and you know, I wasn't really that much excited, but I loved it. So, you know, nourishing shampoo for highly processed or brittle hair. Shampoo 
Ah, that's the same thing in Italian, I think. So this is Nunu Shampoo. So there is that. Okay, so we have uh, a little sample here. I'm not sure if it's going to be mentioned in our booklet, but this is Feed Your Skin Votary Super Seed Nutrient Cream. And we have, I think, one ml over here. So that's like a, that's like a proper sample. <laughs> I hope it's not mentioned here because, you know, it's just a sample. It's just a sample, but let's see. Oh, yeah, it's actually mentioned here. Okay. An update on Votary is called a Super Seed Facial Oil. This soothing cream is a savior for sensitive, dehydrated skin. This daily moisturizer is enriched with grapeseed oil, a non-comedogenic and anti-inflammatory ingredient, along with hyaluronic acid, a hydration hero, and pomegranate seed oil to support cell generation and fortify skin against signs of aging. I really love Votary, but this is like one mil, so that's that's that doesn't even deserve to be mentioned in there, but that that's just my opinion. Okay, the last uh, product is a little bit bigger, luckily, and this is the Seated Queen Cold Cream Cleanser Mask, and we have 30 mils over here. Do you know what? The packaging looks completely new to me. I don't think I've ever seen this in this packaging, but I am pretty sure I have the Seated Queen kind of like cleanser mask thing in like a little pot somewhere. I haven't tried it yet, so I'm curious if this is the same product or something different. Cold Cream by the Seated Queen is a modern classic, boasting an innovative three-in-one formula that works as a cream cleanser, a mask, and an intensely hydrating overnight treatment. This award-winning cream is vegan-friendly and made in the UK using cold-pressed and organic ingredients to effectively cleanse skin while replenishing moisture to leave you with a visibly healthier looking, more clear and radiant complexion. That sounds lovely. It says here, to use as a cleanser, apply a thin veil to face and neck, then remove with a warm dampened cloth. If using as a mask, apply to cleanse skin after serum. So this is a kind of like leave-in mask. Uh, you just apply it on your face and I'm assuming you don't really wash it off. Uh, but I'm really curious how this is going to work as a cleanser. Is it going to remove my makeup or, or is it just going to be something that maybe like I can use as a second step cleanser? So that's definitely something I uh, probably should try uh, quite soon. Uh, and now I'm actually really curious if this is the same product I already have or is it something different? It does sound familiar, like, you know, cold cream, seated queen. I don't know, but I definitely need to confirm that. Anyway, guys, this is everything in the spring uh, beauty drop box from Liberty London. What do you guys think? So just to remind you guys, as you can see, we have this shampoo from Davines. We have a little glycolic acid uh, serum by Sunday Riley. We have the Seated Queen um, multi kind of functional product. We have a bar of soap, uh, 111 skin eye mask, and this little sample of a uh, Voltary product, which I shouldn't even mention. I do think this is a nice box. I mean, bear in mind that this one is free. Obviously only makes sense if you're going to be able to spend that money on um, Liberty London, but Otherwise, it's still a free box, and I think as a free box, this one is actually quite good. Uh, this uh, serum is lovely if you like uh, your acids. This uh, Sunday Rally serum is actually really nice. These eye patches are quite pricey, and they're actually really good as well. Uh, I'm always excited to try some new Davines uh, hair products. And then we have quite a generous size of this um, cold cream by the Seated Queen. And then we obviously have uh, this bar of soap, which, you know, some people might not find too exciting, but actually quite like it. But what do you guys think? Let me know uh, what you think in the comment section down below. I would love to know your thoughts. Thank you very much for watching. For more beauty related content, check those videos over here. I'm going to see you very soon. Take care. Bye!